Murphy, a 20-something antisocial blind woman, lives a relatively uneventful life full of drunken hookups and chain smoking, with only Tyson, a teenage drug dealer who befriends her, to confide in. One night, while walking her dog, Murphy stumbles across what she believes to be Tyson's corpse, but when a police investigation turns up nothing, she spirals into depression, culminating in her getting caught cheating with a married man, Bradley, and losing her cane. When she returns to Tyson's old corner, she meets Darnell, Tyson's cousin and supplier, who tells her he's still alive. Bradley's wife, Gail, rescinds a donation she made to Murphy's parents, driving a wedge between her and her mother Joy, who has given up trying to help her. Out of guilt, Murphy agrees to take a receptionist's job in her family's seeing dog school until she can pay them back. Incensed that no one believes her about Tyson, Murphy takes it upon herself to find him and has his phone's GPS tracked so she can find it. She notifies both Darnell and a friendly cop, Dean, but both discourage her from further investigation. Murphy's roommate Jess tells her that she knows Murphy will try to solve the case anyway.